Hello, who's up for some Mass Effect? I know I am. Now, we're not going to do a side quest edition this time, we're going to go on with the story, mainly because we're pretty under-leveled for most of these side quests, and you don't get that much great for doing them. So we're going to jump on over to Ferros. We're not going to the Hercules system, because it triggers a side quest. We're going to Theseus. Let's find some Minotaurs. Because Theseus was the guy who fought the Minotaur, of course. Here we go, we are at Theseus. Let's check out the other planets first quickly. Quana, survey, light metal, found some cobalt, nice. I don't even know what the point of finding these metals is, honestly. <laughs> I, I never collected all of them on my first playthrough. Saitau. Sharing. Yep, that will be a Prothean data disk. Hello. Adams and Tully brought it on board and spent hours taking it apart. The purpose of the object is still uncertain, but it was Prothean in nature and contained a Prothean data disk. I don't know if those do anything. Do they they possibly do something when you've got uh no wait, we already checked this planet. When you've got a certain character in your party in Mass Effect 3? Um, not sure. Anyway, here's Ferros, which is, uh, The Exogeny Corporation has founded a pilot colony on Ferros to explore the Prothean ruins that blanket two-thirds of the planet's landmass. The atmosphere is fouled with dust, terrestrial travel is hampered by crumpled debris dozens of meters deep. There are indications that Ferros was a much colder world in the past. Ferros has two large moons, Orkan and the Orkan, the father, and Vadet. Um, so here we go, we, we uh, surface temperature is 10 Celsius. It's not, it's like super cold, but it's not particularly warm either. Okay, so we're gonna land and uh, see what the deal is on Ferros. Here's uh, Prothean ruins on Ferros. Now you will notice the Prothean ruins don't all have the same architectural style, which is something that will be brought up in later Mass Effect games and that I can't really talk about without spoilers unfortunately. I haven't decided if I'm gonna L L bleh, LP any of the future games in the series, I'm just gonna see how I go with this. I guess, and whether people want me to, whether anybody's interested. Um, so here we go, we're gonna head on out the airlock. Hello Jennifer, hail airlock. Now we're gonna take along our Prothean expert, um, and I guess to uh, flesh out the party, let's take along Garrus, because uh, also Garrus and the Ara, it's my favourite party, just can't really go wrong. Equalizing interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. Very really good. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. Don't do anything racist while I'm gone, Presley. Right. Now, one thing I'd want to quickly do is give Garrus this awesome new weapon that we found. Um, and... Yeah, let's keep that. And have we got any? Yes, we have some armor piercing rounds. Let's put them in there. Maybe I should have given those to Shepard actually. What you got? Uh, oh, they'll have to do. I can't be asked swapping it back, but I might have a better heat sink. No, no. Oh, right. Let's uh. Omnigel some stuff though, because Omnigel is just so useful and it's such a pain when you've run out of it. Right, is there anything I can give to you, Liara? No. Okay then, uh, I think it's auto safe that we got here and I'll just drop a pen on my keyboard. Here we go. I need to tidy my desk. Oh, hello there sir. David Al-Takwani. al Damn it. Fidan wants to Talakani? speak with you immediately. Talakwani? Hmm. 
Who's Fidan? He's our leader. He needs your help to prepare for the Geth. They are making another push. Captain Please, Kirk. Up the stairs past the freighter. Oh. Holy crap. Ah. I hate when the game doesn't let you go and cover properly. Liara, how about you throw a singularity right there? Oh, oh, look at that. That is magnificent. Good Liara, best friend. Space girlfriend. Excellent. Right. Haha, <laughs> you cannot get me. I am invincible. Boom! Up you go. What? Soft kill deployed? Sorry, Liara, I didn't really catch what you were trying to say to me then. Oh, come on. Let's push him. Boom! Ouch. Throw a barrier up, Shep. Boom. Oh, it's a freaking sniper. I hate those things. Come on. Come out of hiding. Gotcha. Yeah, you didn't like that. Oh great, we're jammed. That's sure to mean... Yep! Froggy doofers. Why the hell did you make these quarians? Seriously, what what was the deal? Why? Why did you make them? Ah! Oof. Ow. Don't like you very much. Oh, it overheated my gun. Damn it. Uh. Oh, I like having competent party Perimeter members. Secured. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it. Got my BFF and my space girlfriend, and we're all ready to go. Okay, we're not actually dating Liara yet, but make sure they're secure. Those get are bloody dangerous. Stop saying bloody. You're an American. You're not allowed. Glad to see some soldiers. Our numbers are getting thin. Get ready. If we die of thirst, the Geth will surely kill us all. Well, this is a jolly settlement. How is a woman supposed to think with guns going off all around? Good question. How many roads must a man walk down before you can call him a man? I fear the Geth will kill us all. This town is, um... Yeah, huh. Happy. The Geth are mounting another attack. Are they? Right, um... Guess we'll, uh... No, no, no. Just relax. Hmm? You guys okay? My headache. The Geth just keep coming. Okay. Boom. Let's have a look out here. Hello. Hi. We're here to help. Oh, Commander. I'm glad they finally sent somebody to help us. You're a bit late, aren't you? Arcelia. Sorry, Commander. Everyone's on edge since... Oh. Watch out! We've got Geth in the tower! <sighs> Protect the heart of the colony! Finally, some action! <laughs> Garrus, we, we were just in a fight like minutes ago. Man, I can't wait till our shepherd also gets singularity. It, it's just so much fun. <laughs> level up! We have level up. Everybody likes level up. Um, we got some useless bits, um, yeah, take those, oh. right, uh, 
So we got absolutely nothing of use, but never mind. Right, uh, what we got? We can have. A, might as well. We'll get our points in charm while we can. Um, and we. Yeah, we'll just uh, do that for now. We'll get pl plenty of level ups as the game goes on. Um, now, Liara, what are you gonna have? That. Uh... Oh, yes! It increases the range! Oh, how glorious! Yes, that's going to be fun. Um... Yeah, actually, I might just. Uh... Oh, wait, let's see. Um, yeah, I'll just do that. It gives him just generally extra accuracy and damage. Okay. Wait, where are you? Oh, for <laughs> I don't want to die! Please, don't let me die! Down this way. Commander, I believe we are headed in the wrong direction. The tower is behind us. Ah, um, okay, thanks, Liara. Hmm? <laughs> Elevator's never in service when you want to use it, is it? Right, we're gonna save here quickly because this. I tend to die here. It happens. Um, yep. Okay. I'm gonna. Can I. Away, get out of the way. No. Guys, can you take that out, please? Whoa! So hard to hit. Let's try that again. Right. who can attack the drone, please attack the drone. Liara also attack the drone. Everybody... No, wait, you can't. Just shoot it. Okay, just get it. Oh, damn it, Garrus. Okay, Liara's used barrier, so that's a start. Shepard, use, use barrier. Right, now bring back Garrus. Now... Liara! No, you don't have a damn it. Why don't you oh, lift? Yes. Okay. So just one left. Oof. Where's that sniper? Oh, no. Out of the way, get out of the way. Another one? What the hell? Where do you even come from? Just keep coming, don't we? 
Sir, I do not like you very much. Oh. Well, there you Got him. Are there any more of you? Whoa. How oh, good. I guess they decided to give up. Now we can update Fidan and get a vehicle safely out of the Normandy. The Geth base is our next objective. Guess it is. Is there any treasure in here? Oh. I wanted treasure. But let's go back to the colony. I apologise for that having taken two attempts. Um, it was kind of embarrassing. Wait, Garrus, have you got... Yeah, sure, I'll take the armor plating. Garrus, have you got some sort of first aid thing in there? No. First aid interface. And it goes... Right, and off we go. Hello. The tower's secure. Thanks to you, Commander. Happy to help. I'm just glad your colony's safe. I appreciate your concern and your efforts against the Geth. They may have been slowed, but they'll be back. They always come back. Help me find what the Geth are after and you'll all get out of here alive. We don't know what they're after. They came, they attacked us, that's all we know. Their main base is at the Exogeny headquarters. A good place to start looking if you want answers. Hmm. What's Exogeny? It's the company most of us work for before the attacks. They fund this colony. The Skyway leads directly to Exogeny headquarters. You can't miss it. Of course, there's an army of Geth between here and there. Sounds fun. I didn't expect this would be easy. Then maybe I can get this colony operational again. What can you tell me about the defenses the Geth have set up? I don't have any details, but I'll wager it's a lot more fortified than the command post. They landed at least one Geth ship at Exogeny, and I've seen large walking tanks on the Skyway. Expect a hard fight. What do you need done to get this place back on its feet? We need those Geth destroyed. Arcelia's right. There are still Geth in the tunnels. We also have more mundane problems like food, water, and power. I'm not sure where we stand on those matters. You should talk to the people overseeing them. Hmm. Is there anything I can do to solve your water shortage? Maka Doyle has been assigned to that particular issue. If you have any insight to offer, please speak with her. Okay. Let's talk about Zeus, Hope, and Pharos in general. Of course, Commander. Tell me about your colony. Life is hard and often brutal, even without our current problems. Colonial Affairs back on Earth told us we'd be beneath the notice of any raiders. I guess they weren't counting on the Geth. But, despite everything, there's something tranquil about this place. Unlike anything I've experienced before. How big was the original Pharos colony? We were nearly a thousand at the main site. Two hundred more at my outpost. When the first wave obliterated our defenses, we fell back to Zeus Hope. The Normandy isn't huge, but we could airlift you out. The Geth fighters are too dangerous. And I won't be driven off this world. It is our home. There's a chance for growth here that's simply not available on other worlds. Hmm. What else can you tell me about Exogeny? Exogeny funded this colony. Without them, we wouldn't be stuck here. They specialize in colonization. In return for bankrolling the colony, we work for them. Their main goal is the retrieval of valuable artifacts or resources. Except there isn't anything here. Or if there is, we didn't find it. I wonder if that's what the Geth are looking for. Perhaps. As she said, we never found anything of value. Of course, the Geth could know something we don't. I'll talk to you when I learn more. Good luck, Commander. Okay, um, so we've got this whole new quest, and it's all very exciting. Uh, let's just talk to a few of the colonists, uh, just... You'll have to forgive my wife. Kalantha's not in her right mind. She just needs to relax and accept what's happened. What do you do for the colony? I'm a medic. 
Or I am since the doctor died. I've tried my best since she was killed. Do you know anything about this planet? Just what I was told by Colonial Affairs. It's a little different from what they claimed. It, it's not all bad, though. When the Geth are gone, we'll have a chance to create something even more spectacular than before. What happened to your wife? The constant attacks have strained us all. She'll adapt. We all have. Is there anything I can do for her? No, she just needs time. Time to absorb everything. We'll be fine. Hmm. Tell me about the colony. I can't tell you much about that. You'd best ask Fi Dan if you really must know. Why can't you tell me? I just want to know about the colony. Fi Dan is our leader. Who better to answer questions about the colony? Do you have any idea what the Geth were looking for? Uh, I can't think of any reason for an attack like this. We just wanted to build a home. Hmm. I have to go. Hello, Offworlder. I'm glad that we aren't totally forgotten by the rest of the galaxy. Dear, please try to rest. You're, you're not ready to speak. But they should know... Uh... I mean, they are very important. Yes. That's better. Is there anything I can do for you? I'm fine. I just need to try to think clearly. It's just a lingering pain from... from the last attack. I'll be fine. I can't see any significant damage, but something is clearly causing her pain. Please, just let her rest. She just needs rest. Hmm. Something weird about this colony. Everybody seems a bit strange. Mr. Reynolds. You're the one who repelled that last wave. Yes, I am. They'll be back. And if the Geth don't kill us, we'll die of hunger soon enough. Careful. Are you doing anything to remedy the situation? I need to boost rations with Varen meat, but it's too dangerous. The Alpha Varen, he's huge and he's mad. Rabid, maybe. Totally uncontrollable. I can't do anything until he's dead. I have a ship. I could bring in supplies from off-world. I'd rather you concentrated on the Geth. Food won't help us if they breach our defenses. Okay... Tell me about hunting Varen. Hunting them is impossible while fending off the Geth. On the positive side, they'll attack anything, even those damn synthetics. The big Alpha Varen is the real problem. He's mad, erratic, completely unpredictable. All right. So we've got I a, have to go. a so quest long, there. We can um, hunt. So much suffering, so much death, yet still they stay and fight. I can't believe the colony held out as long as it did. So we get all of these little quests on this planet, which is interesting. It, it feels... Commander, I was told to make my supplies available to you, if you wish. It feels very much more like an older, kind of more classic RPG-style game, whereas the late ones in the series had a, a more action-y feel to them, I guess. Um... How do you keep things in stock in conditions like this? My list of consumers has shrunk significantly since the attacks. And few of those have time for shopping. Let me see what you have. Of course. We've got a shop. I may be able to provide a few interesting items. Which is a pretty nice shop, actually. Uh, how's the stiletto like as it compared to my current stinger? Slightly less accurate. It's got fewer shots before overheat, but it does do considerably more damage. How about the stiletto five? Mm, it's not that great, so selection isn't amazing. But yeah, we've got all of these uh, different quests, so I'm going to finish this episode for now and we'll pick up all of the quests next time and get on with our investigation. So I will see you next time.